How is it going today, my friends? As always, I hope you all are having yourselves a fantastic day. After almost a week of not making videos, it is good to be doing my intro, and it is good to be making a video. Why does it not surprise me that the first ground war lobby that I get into, Dom Vacant, is the map and the game mode getting voted. It's also not a surprise to me at all that I also voted Dom Vacant because it's pr it's a pretty good warm-up map and game mode. But still, come on, people. They didn't remaster this game just for us to play Vacant, did they? Did they? I think they honestly did and every single person in this lobby is probably okay with it ain't that right 420 smoke dog if you are a very active subscriber of this channel you notice that the past few days I didn't upload a video now it isn't unusual for me to miss one upload day every blue moon but for me to miss three maybe even four days of uploading what the fuck Carl what the hell's going on well for the first time ever I didn't mind that I was missing uploads I wasn't like fuck I'm not uploading a video today I am so upset I am so angry with myself because I couldn't upload a video today. I was at my aunt and uncle's visiting for Christmas and there was a lot of family there. Two of my uncles and two of my aunts that I haven't seen for a very long time drove down and basically I've known that we we're going to be going there for Christmas since Thanksgiving but hindsight being the bitch that it is I should have immediately started working on extra videos immediately after Thanksgiving but you know shit happens I only ended up making two extra videos and you know that's all I had for while I was there. I stayed for four or five days and the days that I didn't upload a video because I was just having such a good time and I was just enjoying myself so much I didn't fucking care that I didn't have a video up that day now obviously there is a part of me that would have liked to have a video up that day sure I would have been really happy if I could have gotten a video up that day but even though I couldn't get videos up on those days I really didn't mind it really didn't upset me as it normally would normally when I miss a video I get pretty upset I'm like damn you know I've really disappointed the fans today they're gonna fucking riot I'm dead oh Ah! Uh, I could have shot four no-scopes there and gotten four people. Too bad we're stuck in the reality where I only got one fucking kill there. And I somehow managed to no-scope the guy that was behind the person in front of me. So yeah, that being said, I think it's pretty obvious that I had a great Christmas with my family. I really hope that you guys had an amazing Christmas too. Can you close my door, please? Can we close my door, please? Honestly, I can't even call this game mode ground war anymore. It's just choke war. It's literally just a war of the chokes for me. All I do is see large amounts of people get one kill and fucking die. Oh man, Christmas is over. I gotta take off this fucking festive camo. The festive camo is now considered out of style. Oh man, I hate having a fucking band-aid on your thumb. It's also a nice thing to have right now because whenever I fail and or miss, I can just blame it on the fucking band-aid. Oh! Oh! <laughs> no! Why? Why? A no-scope hit marker for the quad feed, then I saw fifth. That could have even been a sixth. Fuck you. Fuck everything you stand for, game. Could have been epic, but no. No, 50 caliber sniper rifles just have to get hit markers. That's just the thing I don't understand about this game. The M40A3 is a one-shot to the fucking toenail, but my Barrett 50 cal can't be a one-shot to your liver. I got bummed just now. I checked my text messages, and my friend Mark said he might have to... <laughs> bail on me my homie's gonna bail on me the world is fucking ending i haven't seen him for almost a week so i just really wanted to chill with him and as soon as i left for my aunt and uncles for christmas a few hours later a package from egl with 10 items of my apparel got delivered to my house and he went and picked it up for me so that i wouldn't be sitting here for a few days while i was at my aunt and uncles and he didn't get a chance to go drop it off at my mom and dad's for me so you know he was gonna come over chill and you know bring me all of my apparel if he can't chill that means i can't get my apparel and if i can't get my apparel tonight oh i'm gonna be one sad carl <sighs> did you see all those people D did you see how i only got fucking one of them Yeah, as far as Christmases go, this was literally the best Christmas ever. I had so much fun there in just a few days. So much laughing. I just had such a good time. Everyone who I got gifts for absolutely loved their gifts. So that just made me so happy. I got both of my uncle's drones, mini drones. We did a Secret Santa thing where everyone got one person to buy something for. And Alicia and I both got one of my uncles. So I bought them both the same drone. And then another gift too. And they both just loved them. So that made me really happy. And then my parents and my sister liked their gift. And then my parents parents went all out and just decided fuck it we're gonna get carl the dopest longboard ever so yeah 
I have the dopest longboard ever now. It looks so nice, you don't even want to ride it, but then you stand on it, and all you want to do is fucking ride it. Still haven't rode it. Had it for a few days, but my friend Philip, who I longboard with, has the same type of longboard. And a few days before Christmas, they found the place that made the longboard that my parents got me. They didn't know I was getting it yet, of course, and they were just freaking out about how awesome these longboards looked and how great they were. And what do you fucking know? My parents end up surprising me and getting me the exact type of longboard that they were talking about for Christmas. And I'm just waiting for my friend Phil to get back from Jacksonville to ride it for the first time because I I stood on it for a few seconds and it just feels so good and I want to share that awesome moment with my homie. But man, is it killing me. All I want to do is drive to a newly paved road and fucking carve. I can't do any slides or longboard tricks or anything like that, but I just love riding really fast and carving the streets. It's just, it's just a great feeling. If you've ever longboarded for before, then you know exactly what I mean. I don't need to explain the awesomeness to you. You've already experienced it many a time before, if you've longboarded before. I'm literally the fucking best sniper that has ever been in phase. Yeah, you guys know I have my moments, and you gotta cut me some slack. I haven't played for almost five days. Oh, and oh, don't don't forget the band-aid either. You gotta cut me some more slack for that. Oh my god. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, what are you standing around for? No way, you fucking jug using turn! Not only did he hide from the quad feed, but even if I would have hit him, it would have just been a goddamn hit marker. <laughs> oh my god, he ruins everything. Simply by having one perk on, he can crush all of my hopes and dreams. It's fucking terrible. Just turn my chat volume up for a second, and there's some fans in the lobby. Hello? Alright, hey Carl, hey, 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 everybody. I guess I can't fool the fans. What's up, everybody? Yo, no fucking way! Dude! Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm in this game! No way! Hello! Hello, hello! Hello, hello. What if I told you that you were on YouTube? Hmm. No way, oh my God. God. No way. Dude, I told you It hey, appears I... that that has excited them. Hola, como estas, señor? Me llamo Carlos. I said, hola, como estas, señor? Me llamo Carlos. I'm sorry, that's all I know how to say. Yo tengo un pollo en mi cabeza. Come on, teammates, step it up. Fuck it. Jug! Why? Why? Why are you a thing? Oh, there's hella people. There's hella people. <laughs> Doesn't matter how many fucking people there are if you suck like me. Blame it on the band-aid. When putting a band-aid on your thumb, expect a 25% increase in shitty accuracy. <laughs> all people do in this game is just sit back with the snipers. I know all I'm doing is running around with a sniper, so you know, there's barely a difference. And I can't tell you how many times I get killed by people who are just sitting in the back of their spawn, hard scoping. Sniping is just such an easy thing to do on Call of Duty 4 that a lot of people who normally don't snipe just snipe. In tomorrow's video, I will be showing all of the pieces of apparel that I got for myself so that some of you can get an idea of what it looks like. Also, I'm going to be doing a giveaway soon. I want to get it set up on one of those websites so, to where you can like earn points by doing different things for the giveaway, either tweeting it, subscribing to my channel, etc, etc. If you've entered a giveaway, if you've entered a giveaway before, I'm sure you're familiar with one of those things. If my friend Mark doesn't end up coming over tonight, I will end up driving over to his house to grab the apparel. So in tomorrow's video, I will be showing it. And then for the giveaway, basically there's going to be a few winners. I'm not sure if I'm going to pick three winners or five winners yet. I haven't decided. And basically if you win the giveaway, way you can pick absolutely any item from the website and that's what you get so if you want a hoodie you get a hoodie but say you just want a backpack or something like that because they're so cheap if someone decides that they want a backpack they can also choose one of the stickers that they would like as always if you want to see my apparel and you want to see what all the designs look like the link to it is always in the description of my videos and yeah hopefully i can get that giveaway rolling soon now i'll also be doing another
another giveaway for the subscribers of my Twitch live stream. Speaking of that, now that I'm back from my aunt and uncles, you can be expecting a lot more streaming. And yeah, basically when I get 500 subscribers on my Twitch live stream, I will be doing a giveaway very similar to this one, except it will only be for those 500 subscribers. And basically five of those 500 subscribers will get to do the same thing and they will get to choose one piece or a backpack and a sticker from my apparel website. That's basically just two different giveaways and two different chances for you guys to possibly win my apparel. For any of you who would be interested, that should be happening soon. I'm really going to try not to procrastinate on this one. But knowing me, it could always happen. And by it could always happen, it could take a while to happen because I procrastinate a lot, which is not good, but I still do it. Alright guys, that is where I'm going to end today's video. If you wouldn't mind leaving a thumbs up to let me know that you enjoyed it, at least a little bit. You know I would appreciate that very much. And as always, my friends, I hope you all have yourselves a fantastic day, afternoon, night. Doesn't really matter when you're watching this. I hope you have a good one. A farewell, a goodbye, and here comes that motherfucking- Woo! Oh. Hey.